Welcome, I am back home from work. I, it was a long day. It was my first day of teaching and yesterday I was so stressed. I, I was so close to having a panic attack because I almost did, um, but it was actually way better than I thought it would be. So I thought it was really nice and I know the kids were lovely, so I love that. By the way, <laughs> for those who are new here, hi, my name is Daniela and I work as an English teacher for a kindergarten in China. So come along and look at my journey. <laughs> So after work, once again, I walked around to explore the area because this is my fourth day here and I still don't know where anything is. So I went and we have, I bought a ton of things and by ton I mean quite a lot, but a lot of these I needed. Let me start with the one I need the most, a broom and a duster. That's like, I was desperately needing this. Uh, they also had the mops, but I already had too much to carry with me at that point. So I didn't buy it. Um, there's also no supermarket close, that close to me. Uh, there's like a bunch of small stores or um, there's like a closed little market and there are a bunch of vendors inside selling things. There was one with fish and I really, really wanted to buy shrimp. They had them live and everything. I just, I didn't have a recipe in mind and if I just bought them, then I would have realized that I'm missing so many things um, because I didn't even have salt until today. So um, I, I postponed that because that market's gonna be there for a long time. So let me show you what I got and let me talk about it. I guess. It's not that exciting, but for me it's like so exciting. So first I bought this bento box um, because at lunch at work they give us food, which is really nice. Um, like obviously free food, I'm not gonna say no. Um, it's also Chinese food, which is amazing because if I were to try to make it on my own, following a recipe, it would be a disaster. And there's so many ingredients in the Chinese recipe that I'm like, let me try these at the kindergarten because it's free, it's really good food and it's very filling as well. So that's fantastic. Uh, but at the kindergarten, everyone has like metal um, boxes, things. Um, and I bought this one because I never finish my food. There's always too much. And I even put little, um, but I got this. So then when I'm done, I can just close it and take the leftovers home because why not? Um, and it's really nice because it also has a spoon and chopsticks inside. So I'm like, yes, nice. So now I borrowed someone else's. So now that I have it, I am all set. I just need to wash it and put it in my bag so I don't forget it to take it tomorrow because <laughs> knowing myself, I definitely will. So this is important. Then I got some other essentials. This is detergent. I'm surprised that they have Tide here because there's a lot of companies they don't have, but uh, this is here and some cleaning gloves. Uh, because I need them. I also need something to clean the washing machine with, but we're getting there, okay? <laughs> Slow but steady, we're getting there. After that, I bought this giant bag of pasta. Do you see how big it is? It's huge. Um, but I don't know, it wasn't that expensive and you can never go wrong with pasta coming from a European, so... Um, I don't know, you, you, it's pasta. It's a different shape than I'm used to and I'm not sure what it's made of. Maybe like sweet, what is this, yam? I don't know, but oh God, I'm breaking every single one of them by holding this, but I got that. And I was looking, like one of the main things to buy today was salt and I was looking for like shakers of salt because just a salt shape thing. Uh, but I didn't see it anywhere. And then I asked someone, I Google translate like salt and <laughs> I showed it to them and they're like, oh, it's there, it's there. So uh, this is what salt looks like. 
Um, I will have to either like hold it well or put it somewhere else, but I think I'll take the lazy root out and just uh, snip a little bit here and then just fold it like this because it's salt, okay? Let's not be over dramatic here, but finally have salt. Yesterday I used a little salt packet I took from the airport meal and I'm so glad I did because I had no salt and I was making a soup and I realized while I was making it that I didn't have salt um, or any other condiments by that matter. Then I got these snacks. Uh, I think I'm going to do like a snack video, like a Chinese, well, things, snacks I bought in China because I don't think all of them are Chinese and don't come after me. Uh, but this is one of them. Then I bought these little mushrooms that are like chocolate and biscuit. And then I got this, this looks like a squid to me. I'm not sure if it is. And after I bought it, I realized that it says, there's like a microwave here or an oven because it says 70 degrees. And I'm not sure if I have to cook it because if I do, I'd rather not. But maybe I do have to cook it and if so, Let's hope that boiling works because that's the only thing I have. So I'll have to look into this. Um, and then I got myself some tea. I will have to look what kind of tea this is because it doesn't say, but it does have zero calories, which is obvious because it's tea, but I love tea. And that was it for snacks. I will make it another video again, look forward to that. And I will do it so that I taste it as I buy them and gather more things and then put the video because right now I don't think I have enough for one video. But I also don't want to buy a ton of snacks, open them all, try them and then have to have them open for a long time. So um, I don't want to, to go stale or waste food. So I'm going to um, try them as I go. So we're doing that. And I also got some chopsticks. These are, um, one uh, like single use but i am going to reuse them and some measuring tape and when i was walking home i bought this this is like a um fried dough something it's sweet uh it was like four yuan which is really cheap for this um like really cheap in my opinion um and i look forward to try it that i look so forward to try it and from uh, the kindergarten. Once again in the morning, I don't know why, but my principal gave me an egg and she gave me one yesterday as well. And I thought it was just a raw egg. So I was like, I'll give her this for breakfast. And in the morning I prepared my pan and put some oil in it. And as I cracked my egg, it was boiled. <laughs> like it was a hard boiled egg. So now I know, uh, I'll probably eat it either today or tomorrow, but she gave me another egg today. Um, probably hard boiled as well. It'd be messed up if it wasn't. Uh, and then she gave me like a little, what do you call them? I had to Google this because I fully forgot. I never eat these. She gave me a fig. <laughs> Look at this. So cutely wrapped and everything. It's probably not focusing, but it is very pretty. I just, I'm not a huge fan of figs, but I will make sure that I eat this um, because she very kindly gave it to me. Thank you very much. I don't know what I did to deserve um, such nice treatment, but I really truly appreciate it. So thank you. <laughs> um, but this was the fig and this was the egg that I got from my principal. Now I'm going to make something for dinner and just relax. Tomorrow uh, I asked if I have to like prepare a class or anything like do I have something to do and she's like no no that's okay tomorrow's like an exercise day um, so I'll just help with the exercise and like participate in them. Uh, so I'm so glad I don't have to teach tomorrow even though that's why I'm here because I can just gather myself a bit. I have been going non-stop since I arrived here so it's good to have a little break. Uh, also today I went to get uh, pictures taken for my medical exam that I'm going to have tomorrow. So first I'll have the medical exam, which means I won't be able to eat in the morning. And then 
I'll go back to the kindergarten and help out. Um, and since the moon festival is going to be from Sunday to Tuesday, um, I'll also have to work on Saturday. I'm back very soon, I know, but I washed my hands and now I want to try this thing. I was so excited. And it just smells so good as I was passing through there. Um, when I said, like, I pointed it to the lady and I said, one. <laughs> She said something I didn't understand and then she pointed to the inside uh, that I have to pay for it there So I went to inside to pay for it and she shouted something to the person inside so they know what I was paying for um, and then I paid the four yuan that this costed and I went back outside because and they gave me a bag so I went back outside and pointed to the lady what I wanted and she said something. I think she was asking about some variety or something like, I don't know what she was saying. No idea, but I just said one please. <laughs> and she gave me this one. So let's try this. Oh, look at this. You cannot see it focused, but it's so beautiful. I promise to you it is. Please focus on the bread nonsense. Okay, let's try. Mmm, it's filled with something. It's like a cream. I didn't expect it, anything to be in here. Oh, that's nice. I don't know what it is. Mm. So good. It's very moist. Not moist is not the right word. It's very soft on the inside. The bread just so soft. Um, the out uh, the exterior is really nice and crispy as you can see golden brown and the cream inside i don't know what it is i think it's obviously something dairy based i believe but look there's like a hole in the middle going through it um but it's delicious i i wasn't expecting cream at all but it's really good it's very buttery it's very sweet, but not, well, the bread is really nice at keeping the balance between the sweet because the cream is a little bit overpoweringly sweet, but this is delicious. 100% would buy again. Probably will, which is not good for my health because it's way too close to where I live and I don't have very much self-control, so I might get too many of these, but this is really good, so I'm really glad I got it. Okay, I'm going to eat this whole thing. Bye! Hi! So this is editing me. Um, <laughs> I planned on having this video be an entire week in my life, but so far I have two hours worth of footage just for this week, so I'm going to split them up. So I'm going to end this video here because two hours people okay that will never load on youtube with my internet but this was this day i hope you enjoyed it it was mostly grocery haul and snack review well pastry review but i hope you liked it if you did please give it a like please comment below anything you'd like to tell me and please consider subscribing for more future content because i promise i have a lot of it so make sure you're subscribed okay bye i just give the earth my soul hear my thoughts bounce off the walls